Okay. So, um, you know, just uh, if if I ever go somewhere and you, you don't want to talk about it, that's cool. I'll just say, ah, no comment. Yeah. And um, sometimes I might ask you, to, you know, I might go back to a question if I felt that, you know. Okay. Yeah. So, um, I guess I'm going to first start talking to you about um, uh, steroids. Okay. Um, and uh, like how they're done and things like that. Okay. Okay, so when did you start taking steroids? I started taking steroids uh, 19, was it 90? Four. In 1994, I started uh, using anabolic steroids. And uh, why do you take steroids? Uh, Bodybuilding, um, competing wise. Um, to, uh, okay. Tell me, tell me why oh. you take them. Okay. I um, take steroids uh, to compete. Um, I use them only for competition time, uh, maybe 10 weeks before a show. And um, that's it. I don't use uh, steroids off season or anything like that. <laughs> and um, why are you open about your steroid use? Um, the, yeah. One of the main reasons, I guess, one of the reasons why I'm. Uh, um, did I use steroids? No, no. But you're open. Open, about to, open to steroids is that. Um, uh, no, no, no. Um, why are you open about your use? Am I open about my use of it? Why yeah, are you. Because people usually. Oh, open about my using it because, um, okay, the reason why I'm open about the use of using anabolic steroids, when I was first starting to compete or just starting to work out, um, I used to ask questions about, you know, why a certain look a certain way, and um, I never got the truth, put it that way, and um, I felt that after I found out the truth, um, I said to myself that I wouldn't lie to anybody. Anybody asking me a question about um, how I get a certain way and why about bodybuilding, then I just talk about steroids because I mean, people lie to me about it and I just want to be truthful about it because there's no shame in what I do. And that's what I do. It's my business, really. You know, and I don't feel like I want to lie. Why do I have to lie about it? If you do what you do it. What attracted you to bodybuilding? Actually, uh... I really wasn't attracted uh, as far as me being attracted to bodybuilding. I was really never attracted to bodybuilding. Actually, I didn't like the men because I heard that bodybuilding men, you know, they weren't all that. <laughs> but um, I used to be an exotic dancer and I had a, a friend that used to come watch me dance and he was a bodybuilder competitor and he used to bug me all the time. I thought I had the genetics for bodybuilding. And he invited me to the gym, and one day I picked up the weights, and I fell in love with the weight training. And, you know, there you have it. My experience being a female bodybuilder, trust me, sometimes um, it's no walk in the park. Uh, it, uh, I have uh, people come up to me sometimes and say, are you a man or a woman? I mean, come on. I mean, I have earrings. I know men nowadays, There's maybe they think I'm a transvestite. I don't know. But I, I think it's pretty rude anyway to ask someone whether or not they're a man or a woman. If, if, even if I saw a, a transvestite walking down the street, I'm not going to go up to the transvestite and say, are you a transvestite? I just think it's rude. But that's one thing that I don't like when someone asks me whether or not I'm a man or a woman. And I personally don't think I look like a, a man. Do you think I look like a man? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I look like a man. <laughs> um. What, um, do you feel that you started attracting a different man? <laughs> like, yeah, honey, it got, as far as me attracting different men, <laughs> it got worse. 